Great to see you. you're looking incredible, buff as always. But after today's video, you're gonna be a little buffer. Is that a buffer? More buff. <laughs> buff as hell. Whatever. You get the idea. Today we're talking about adding muscle. I'm gonna talk about how you build muscle, but then I'm gonna talk about five supplements that can help you build it a little better. Before I get started, I want to issue a little disclaimer. Because we're talking about something that you consume, um, put into your body, you need to do your own research. Learn, educate yourself. Don't just take my opinion for it or somebody else's opinion. Do your own research and decide if it's right for you. So as many of you know, four weeks ago, I started a weight loss, muscle building, get in the best shape I possibly can journey. I've partnered with bodybuilding.com. You guys have watched any of my recent videos, you know that I am pumped literally and figuratively, to be teamed up with Bodybuilding.com. They are flying me out to Boise to go to their headquarters, film a series of workout videos. They have let me design a six-week workout plan, diet plan, lifestyle plan. They said, yo, would you like to put together a six-week plan? I said, absolutely, but the only way I can do it is if I actually do it. It's been four weeks since I started my plan, and these are the results. The picture on the left was taken four weeks ago. My weight was 155 pounds. The picture on your right was was taken this morning, I weighed 149 and a half. So what do you think? Not bad, right? Well, if you want to know how I sort of did this and the program that I'm on, guys, there's a link down below to our bodybuilding.com custom landing page. There you're going to find the last two videos that I've done talking about the process. First one was about fat loss. I talk about the supplements I'm taking, Quadricarn, L-carnitine, and CLA. These two supplements in terms of a incredible fat burner, like, like, obviously, I've lost like five, six pounds of fat in the past four, five weeks. Um, and it's, it's ridiculous. Um, I'm also doing some fasted cardio, which I know a lot of people are like, oh, it's bro science. Really? I have been getting more emails from dudes that have joined me on this journey because in that video I asked, I said, oh, yo, who's with me? I've been getting more emails from dudes saying, yo, for the first time in my life, I'm seeing results. I'm doing fasted cardio, 30 minutes, first thing in the morning, empty stomach. I'm taking these two pro... Like... Bro science or not, the shit works. On that landing page, you're also going to find a discount that you can use on anything that bodybuilding.com sells because they sell more than just supplements. They sell cool workout gear, like apparel, all sorts of stuff. But on that page, you're also going to find the 10 items along with some other items and the items we're going to talk about today for muscle building that you can actually get a discount on. Best price online. Let's get buff. How do you build muscle? Real quick, in a nutshell, the way that it works. You go into the gym, you pump iron, you lift weights, you do squat, deadlift, but all that good stuff. And what happens, your muscle fibers break down. They get damaged, actually. And then you eat protein, which is made up of amino acids, some essential, some non-essential. Eat the protein, it digests, it starts to break down, and then it shuttles these little amino acids to your muscles to help rebuild it. And when it rebuilds, it's bigger, stronger, more massive muscle. The question I see all the time is, do I need supplements to get bigger muscles? Can I just eat? Can I just work out? The answer is, yeah, you can do that. And when you're starting an exercise program and you really haven't been doing much, that's pretty much all you need. But as you progress, as it becomes more of a lifestyle and habit and your body starts to respond, the gains and the results start to slow down. And supplements are an amazing way to sort of get yourself to respond and get yourself seeing results a little bit faster, a little bit better. So now I'd like to talk about the five supplements that I personally feel are the best for building muscle and keeping muscle. Whey protein. This is, in my opinion, the single most important supplement that somebody can take if you're looking to pack on quality muscle mass. Um, this one from Optimum Nutrition I absolutely love. It's got an incredible amino acid profile. After I work out, every time I take a scoop of whey protein, just mix it with water, I'm going to get 24 grams of easily absorbable protein. And the reason why, in my opinion, it's better to consume whey protein as opposed to just eating a chicken breast is because right then after a workout, your muscles are damaged. They're hungry. They're like sponges. You eat a chicken breast, your body's got to process it. It's got to break it down. It's got to like convert it. It's got to do a whole lot of things to break it down to amino acids or the individual amino acids that your muscles actually need. When you take something like a whey protein, it's like, it's like ready to go. It's like ready to rock. And so within like an hour, it's in doing its thing, which is rebuilding your muscles, bigger, stronger, and more amazing. Whey protein, 
you need it. Like, this is like a must have. Guys, there's a link down below to our bodybuilding landing page if you want to check that one out. Super delicious, affordable, and amazing. The second product that I feel, and I'm going to do these in order of importance. Can you guess what it is? The second most important muscle building supplement? fish oil. Omega-3 fish oil is, in my opinion, the second most important thing that you should be taking if you're looking to maximize your muscle mass gains. The reason fish oil is amazing. It helps your hair. It helps your skin. It helps your brain. Fish oil also has been shown to increase protein synthesis, right? The whole synthesis thing is what you're looking for. You take this and your muscle, this with this, amazing. The other thing that fish oil is great for, it reduces cortisol levels. Cortisol levels are the stress hormone, which is nasty, nasty stuff. It also helps and aids in recovery. The whey protein, fish oil, those two, in my opinion, are critical for, for muscle building. Number three is the next most important. If you're looking to pack on as much mass as possible, creatine monohydrate. If you're somebody who's been working out for a while and you have not tried or taken creatine, you got to try it. This stuff is incredible. Um, there, you, you used to say like you got to load it, you got to take like 10 grams for the first day. I say go with five grams a day. That's all you really need and, and you're going to see a dramatic result in the way that your muscles look. They're going to get more full after about a week of taking this stuff. I'm telling you, creatine, real deal. Number four is something called beta alanine. It's an amino acid and this works incredibly well when combined with creatine. They basically kind of help do the same thing. They help increase output. Um, there's something called carnosine which is very difficult for your body to absorb. Beta alanine helps like buffer it, it, it's very scientific now with beta alanine there's a lot of mixed like information out there online some people think it's amazing some think it, people think it sucks you know I personally think that it works and and it works better when you combine it with creatine um, the combo I personally feel is an amazing way to add something to your workouts and, and your supplementation program just to see what your potential really is. And last but certainly not least, the fifth supplement that I personally feel is awesome for muscle helping you, I should say, maintain muscle mass is L-glutamine. Muscles are made up of like 80% glutamine or something like that. And as you exercise, right, you deplete it, it goes away, but then your body can make more. But if you don't give it enough time to rest or you're, you're intensely training, personally, I feel like supplementing glutamine five to 10 grams a day is critical. I feel like glutamine helps you maintain muscle mass, especially when you're dieting. Uh, because, you know, you're on a lower calorie diet, you want to make sure that your muscles are not wasting or going away. And so I take glutamine and honestly, do your research. And if you're interested in trying any of the supplements that we talked about, hit that link and grab them at a discount. They're all crazy affordable. Glutamine, like this thing, it's like super affordable. Fish oil, crazy affordable. So, like everything is incredibly affordable and with our discount you're going to find them cheaper and our link than anywhere else on the internet and if you're interested in joining me on this process of getting in better shape and feeling incredible you got to hit that link and watch the last two videos that i've done for bodybuilding.com it talks about the program that i'm putting together it also talks about the program that i'm doing you know i've been on it for four and a half five weeks now and and I feel incredible, I look great, the results are coming, and I'm excited because I know the program that I'm putting together for them and with them, you guys are gonna absolutely freaking love. Gentlemen, thanks for watching. Live strong, live safe, and do your cardio.